Hi everybody, I thought I'd do you a quick video of my Ego setup. Um, so what have I got? I've got my 21 inch um, self propelled mower. I've got my Z6 ride on zero turn tractor. I've got my Ego blower. And over there, I've got the first generation uh, Ego Strimmer, which I've had now probably for six, seven years. Um, same again, the first generation Ego uh, Hedge Cutter. Uh, and then over there is my multi-tool, which I use as a pole hedge cutter with the carbon fiber extension. Um, now this is my zero carbon setup. I've got my um, solar control over there for my four um, solar panels I've got on the roof, which goes down to my storage battery under there, which is a 225 amp hour lorry battery, lorry leisure battery. And that goes to my inverter over to extension E which puts out 240 for charging my batteries. So what I've got set up here is three of the turbochargers. So if I'm out using the zero turn mower, um, now this solar system can only charge one battery at a time. So I can have one battery out of that charging. That's just finished. Um, but I can also run an extension lead out to run charge three batteries at a time so I can have let me just turn that off so I can be running three batteries in the back of the charger and have uh, three batteries in the back of the mower and I can have three batteries charging over there off of uh, customers 240 supply um, And when I get to my next job that I'm using the small mower Set up in the side here is the big 1600 watt um, Mower charger where I can charge All six batteries in one go um, I think Maybe next year, what I'll do is I'll upgrade my inverter to a 2000 watt inverter and I'll get another battery. I'm gonna put both of those batteries under the floor of the van. Now this is a Vivaro long wheelbase. So you can fit the zero to mower in and one um, 21 inch mower in the setup position. You can put two in here if you fold them up. So I've got my whole kit here. I've got my um, back pray, backpack sprayer there for when I put my um, lawn treatment on. Uh, in my side box here, I carry my hand tools, my rake, my loppers, and my weed killer. So I keep my weed killer separate from my lawn care weed killer backpack. I never mix the two, so I never put the wrong stuff on anyone's lawn uh, ratchet straps at the top here to ratchet the bags or stuff down on the trailer so that is a complete lawn care set up there hedge cutting um, if you can see there it's, that is the 42 inch Z6 it just fits in the van um, just clears the battery so you've got two run out boards so you disconnect the trailer take the mower out and then you can drive it back in so that's my full setup i haven't bought we're we're we now we're just in september although i haven't cut any grass probably for the last um four to five weeks i've done a couple i've done a couple this morning and and done some hedging but now we're having some rain after this drought. Um, everything will be kicking off again and we'll run into Christmas. 
Um, here on Halen Island, we cut grass right up to Christmas because we're the island sitting on quite a, a lump of clay. Um, and because we get the wind, it's always pretty dry here. And even if we get some rain, because it's so windy all the time, it dries quite quick and it stays mild so we don't get any frosts. Where in the old days we only used to cut grass for six months, now we're cutting grass for 10 months. Um, I can foresee with this global warming soon we'll be cutting grass 12 months of the year, which is cool by me. So I'm dead anyway. Anyway, any questions on my setup? Uh, Z6 seems to be running okay at the moment. Plenty of uplift for the bagging system, which I do fit in the front here, but at the moment, because the trailer's half empty, I've got all the bagging system in the trailer. Um, and it's picking up quite well at the moment. If you can hear in the background, this is what we have to put up with all day, is just going behind there is a Spitfire. We have a um, air display almost every day. If you want to go in that, it costs about two and a half grand. Okay, everybody, any questions, let me know. Bye.